Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new video. So today we're looking at an Arc Hunter build, which is really helpful in endgame activities and just overall in general. It's gonna allow you to basically spam your grenades, dodge around, get your health back, and it's overall just a really nice spammy build. It's really fun. So firstly, the exotic I use is Shinobu's Vow. So basically this improves your skip grenade and you gain an additional skip grenade charge. Uh, skip grenades return energy when it damages enemies. So basically you can spam these grenades as long as you're hitting the enemies. Now for all the abilities, I go ahead and just use Gambler's Dodge, Triple Jump, Combination Blow, and Skip Grenade, obviously. And then Gathering Storm is the best super for <laughs> Hunter Arc in my opinion. For the aspects, I use Lethal Current. So after dodging, your next melee attack has increased lunge range, jolts the target and creates a damaging aftershock. So basically, if you need to get your grenade back, you can dodge, hit the melee, get a shock off. It's just overall really helpful and it's gonna be helpful to get your abilities back and just do damage if you don't have your nade. Next, I use Flow State. So defeating the jolted target makes you amplified. So when you're amplified, you get your dodging back. Yeah, you, when you dodge, you get your grenade energy back. It's just, you know, dodging, throwing nades, meleeing, dodging, throwing nades, meleeing. It's basically that entire process. For fragments, I use Spark of Ions. Defeating a jolted target creates an ionic trace. For Spark of Resistance, I use while surrounded by combatants, you are more resistance to incoming damage because, you know, you're meleeing enemies, you're trying to get your energy back, all that stuff. I use Spark of Shock, so your arc grenade jolts targets. This is just gonna be helpful with your skip grenade to do more damage. And then I use Spark of Recharge while critically wounded, your melee and grenade energy regenerate quickly. So let's say you throw a grenade, uh, you accidentally miss the nade, you take a bunch of damage, you're gonna get your nade back really fast if you don't have any more. So for the armor mods on the helmet, I use Ashes to Assets twice so you can gain bonus super energy on grenade kills. And since you're spamming your grenade, you're gonna get your suit super really fast and you can change the siphon to whatever you want on the gauntlets i use firepower twice so that when you're getting these grenade kills you can generate a ton of orbs of power which is going to be basically how you get all your energy back all your stuff back and it's really helpful for the chest piece i use charged up twice so that you get armor charge for the legs i use stacks on stacks i also use innervation twice and then i use bomber twice on the cloak with utility kickstart that's the build. Hope you enjoyed this quick guide. Let me know what you think about it in the comments down below. I hope to see you guys in a future video. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you later. Peace out.